Easter eggs in video games cover a vast range of topics, from secret images to secret music to secret messages to out of bounds Easter eggs to the characters flipping us the bird and giving us the middle finger, to the Easter eggs that took years to uncover, and to the crazy wacky and what secrets that you never knew you could discover. And today is the turn of every topic above as we take a look at some super secret Easter eggs in video games. Downside. Driving like that gets you the attention you don't want. Check your wanted meter in the upper right of the screen. The higher it gets, the hotter you get with the cops. LA Rush is a 2005 open world racing adventure developed by Midway Studios and follows the story of Trix Lane and his mission to recoup back his stolen and precious car collection by entering a major series of street races. Anyway, it was just last year and over 13 years after the game's release that the awesome YouTuber 4 Cans, who specialises in glitches, cheats, hacking and finding all kinds of weird and wonderful things hidden in video games, discovered an Outer Bounds Easter egg just to the south of LAX, which is actually impossible to see without hacking. And it was 4 Cans who kindly provided me with his very own trainer to be able to see it. As if you fly to the south of the airport and look closely upon the in-game minimap, it is here where, oddly, you can find the TomTom Tom logo, and a company better known for providing satellite navigation devices. When you reach Kagan's Tower and the Llewellyn Corporate segment in Terminal Reality's 2004 hack and slash title Blood Rain 2, it is here where you'll have to battle your way up several flights of stairs in order to climb up some scaffolding where eventually you can enter this room to which a small cutscene will begin to play. And it is during this cutscene that you can see these doors close behind our next set of enemies. And you may be asking, what exactly is behind them and is there a way to find out? And the answer is yes, as if you freeze time just before you jump into this room and quickly escape the cutscene, then there is a chance that the doors will still be open and give us a brief moment to sneak through into the secret room behind the enemies and be able to discover a secret message that reads, you shouldn't be here, and is much like those classic amusing messages found in GTA and the Duke Nukem series. In Rise of the Triad Dark War, an Apogee Software's 1994 first-person shooter, it is if you utilise any explosive device such as a rocket launcher and use it upon any enemy that their bodies will of course rip into bits and chunks of flesh and body parts will fly across the screen. It's obviously a very quick and gory process and you won't have much time to study this, but on the odd occasion and hidden amongst the carnage is an easter egg that you will miss time and time again unless you record these moments and study them frame by frame, where in some cases you will find that the enemies will have given you the middle finger on their way out. But that's not the only easter egg that gives us the middle finger, as it was just recently in early March that YouTuber Lance McDonald, who produces some awesome videos covering cut content, secrets, unseen and hidden details, managed to fully hack the camera in God of War on the PS4 by apparently entering in a special button combination on the map screen and in doing so was able to uncover an amazing off-camera secret that can only be seen after defeating Boulder the first time you encounter him. And I'd like to say a special thank you to Lance for providing this upcoming footage and you can find links to his channel and original video within the description. I hope that you, of everyone I face, 
taste would finally make me feel something that you can't. When Doom 2016 arrived, it wasn't long before easter eggs were being discovered, and they weren't just being found confined to the gameplay itself, but also within the game's soundtrack. As within the track known as Cyber Demon, you could find pentagrams and the number 666 laced throughout the music by using a spectral display in software such as Audition. Roll forward to this year and Bethesda's latest release of Doom Eternal, and it was just a couple of weeks ago that Reddit user RD1994 found an awesome image lurking at the end of the track named Welcome Home, Great Slayer, which turned out to be the front cover of Doom 2. While in another track and the game's main theme appropriately named Doom Eternal, it is if you swap the track into mono and listen to the last portion that you will find this tribute to Daisy the Rabbit. And I'd just like to say a huge thank you to RD1994 for his detailed descriptions he sent me and for helping me find these awesome easter eggs and you can find a link to his reddit page within the description. Mesa Research Facility. Missing a scheduled urinalysis or radiation checkup is grounds for immediate termination. This is the start of Valve's Half-Life and the first time we lay eyes on the G-Man, a mysterious character, an overseer, an employer, and who is sometimes referred to as a sinister interdimensional bureaucrat and who Gordon and various other characters will come to encounter over the course of the series especially in Half-Life 2 as throughout many of the levels you can find the G-Man watching over Gordon from afar and you can grab glimpses of him if you know where to look before he wanders off, disappears and gets ready for his next appearance which is sometimes very hard to spot. And that actually brings us to our next easter egg as it was in May 2019 that Joe Wintergreen over on Twitter posted a message in regards to a screensaver found in the Kleiner lab in Half-Life 2 to which Valve Software's concept artist and product designer responded saying, Cool, you noticed this. Some Easter eggs are too hard to find. No one ever found the G-Man face I put in Eli's lab. And it is that if you happen to look inside this contraption in Eli's lab before the Vorgons inserts the battery or by simply using no clips to do so, then it is at the end of the tube that you indeed discover the G-Man looking directly back at you. Our final easter eggs today both come from LucasArts 1997 first person shooter and wild west adventure Outlaws. And first up we're heading to the historical missions and to martial training where after taking down numerous criminals James will have the chance to take on three separate bonus missions. And it is in the deputy level and after navigating three dark corridors and taking down nine enemies with a limited amount of bullets a secret passageway will open up and where the game will treat us to an encounter with a dog sporting glasses. An encounter with Max from Sam and Max. And this crazy looking squirrel.
While in the second part of the Civil War mission, there is a huge barn you must enter and a large switch to activate in order to escape. But what you might not know is that this actually activates a secret passage at the opposite end of the barn and which leads on to this rather bizarre Easter egg. Right, well if you have an easter egg you think I should check out for future super secret easter eggs in video games episodes then why not drop me a comment in the comments section below. You can message me at my email address, you can find me on Twitter and even on Instagram. And until next time, thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon.